Hey guys, I'm Chuck. And I'm Allie. And we're Allie Chuck Adventures. This week we are definitely trying something we have not tried really ever. <laughs> <laughs> we are trying a Thousand Trails membership out to see if we are maybe going to give up the state park camping for the summer at least in Florida. Right. We are going to stay here in Venice and enjoy Rambler's Rest Campground. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> well, we are on the road our first summer vacation trip. I just got out of school. My last day was yesterday and we are on the road to Venice. We're trying something new guys. We are actually now Thousand Trail members. Yep. I said I would never want to really do that. Yeah because we're not really much of a um, RV park resort type people. But I was telling Chuck that you know it's so hot this summer and I'm really not much for hiking in the summer because of ticks and everything and so I thought maybe it would be a good idea to enjoy the pool and enjoy the amenities that they provide in the summer. Not only that, I mean we're trying to cut corners because the gas prices are so high that we can't afford to really leave eat. Yeah, Florida we can. very much this summer. Well not only that, but we can't afford really 100 to 125 bucks or whatever it's been every time we stay at the Florida State Parks, which we love. But That's right, because it went up in price. We're trying to... Uh, Try to find a way where we can continue camping this summer and still be able to, uh, you know, not break the bank. So that's speak. right. So we're going to try our first. Mm -hmm. uh, thousand. I guess it won't be our first encore resort because we've stayed in a couple before, but it'll be our first one under the Thousand Trails membership. We are heading to Ramblers Rest in Venice. Well, we're here and we're set up. And it's 91 degrees inside the RV, and we are in full sun. Who wants to be living in Florida? Not this girl. <laughs> Where's the pool, right? So we just spent our first night here at Rambler's Rest. And, and I had a good rest. And we did. <laughs> My eyes are all puffy and Me tired. Too. So this was our first real experience being Thousand Trail members and uh, first night anyway. So when we got here yesterday, they were actually having a little uh, live music and an, a pool party. I went down with my sister and Nick while Allie stayed back and tried to get some rest, but went down and got some hot dogs and uh, we were starving by the time we got here. So it was awesome that they had, uh, they had the uh, party Good. going with the food available. Yeah, the food. Two hot dogs and a bag of chips for four bucks. Can't beat it. We're going to definitely check out the amenities that they have here with the pool and, and probably some shuffleboard and stuff later. You got your hat on. Yeah, it's shielding from the sun. Oh, well, how are you going to get that off with your hat on? You can pull it over. Oh. I did it back in Darby. Well, I gotta say, we're enjoying the resort experience so far. The pool is nice, it's not that crowded. Yep. And they even have a little area where you can jump and frolic in the water from it's, coming from the plastic palm trees. Yeah, it's <laughs> like a, a little spray playground area mm -hmm. where water sprays up out of the ground and comes out of different things. And the hot tub is hot. It's very hot. So we're enjoying it, so. This is actually, a, I think, a really nice uh, idea that we came up with. Um, doing resorts in the summer. Yep, do our resorts in the summer where we can enjoy the pool and, and cool, cooler activities. And mm -hmm. in winter time and the cooler time, we'll- Enjoy the hiking and the- State parks. And the uh, fire pit. Yeah. Having fires, <laughs> campfires. Wait, do you have good 
balance? Nope. Not at all. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Huh. He is terrible like you when you can balance. find something more fun to do with that. Well, he's only gonna fall off foot. Yeah, I'm not gonna. Oh, it's yeah. just sand. It'd be fine. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, that's what you ought to do. It'd be cool. But if you really want to make my video a good one, go ahead and fall. Florida. Talking about prehistoric men living here. Wow. Sloth, you say? Sloth. <laughs> My favorite. <laughs> the mineral springs today because it's $20 a person and if the child is under five is free but our friends are not going to be able to stay but just an hour so we decided that we'll do this today. We'll do this next time we're here yeah. Mm -hmm. 20 is kind gonna of go back to the pool. Plus they said no rain checks so if it rains like it's supposed to here. At 11 o'clock it could rain. We'd be rained out so we're just going to go back and enjoy some free stuff in the pool. Yep. When do you go? I don't go. I'm the left of week. Oh. They have a lot of horseshoes <laughs> going yep. on here. And they have a lot of uh, shuffleboard over by the, uh, on the other side of the road there. Nice playground with the... AstroTurf. Yeah, and then they've got... Putting green putting over green. there. Yeah. Tennis courts, pickleball courts. We are enjoying the amenities here. I don't have any strength. You can't go from one to the next? Heck no! I can do it, I'm walking on my feet in the ground. <laughs> here. <laughs> Feeling like a kid again? Yeah. <laughs> Good for putting game. So are you enjoying the resort thing right now? I was telling Rick earlier that, oh my gosh, I think this is me. <laughs> yeah. Especially in the summer. Well, in the summer. Yeah, because I'm enjoying the pool. Yeah. Definitely. So we're down here at the canoe and kayak launch. And it's really pretty here. The Mayaka River. It is very pretty. Great place to go fishing and take out lunch. They got a bunch of canoes over there. I guess you can rent. Now I know our friends Rick and Carmen. He had uh, stowed his uh, canoe or kayak, I should say, and uh, paddleboard there while they were staying here. So I guess you could use it for that too. I don't know that we're going to get a paddleboard this time, though. Uh, this time's getting away from us. We spent so much time with family and hanging out. 
<laughs> hey, buddy. We just started our first game of shuffleboard here at Rambler's Rest, and Allie is already doing the walk of shame because she didn't get it past that second line down there. Well, I didn't want to push it too hard like Nick did. You said Nick said he pushed it too hard. So oh, yeah. Push it too hard. Yeah, push, <laughs> push it. Push, push it, it real, real good. good. <laughs> I sure love the retired life. <laughs> well, I'm retired for two months, that is. <laughs> and, and we're playing shuffleboard. Yep. And I don't know where this game got the, the stigma of being an old person's game. This game's fun. Yeah. I love it. It is awesome. So Nikki is our referee. Hey Nikki. Hey Nick. Are you uh are you being our goalkeeper? You being the scorekeeper down there? Mm -hmm. Checking out the dog park now. Yep. This is a little fenced in area for the dogs. Nikki's like, it's about time you guys let me do something fun. Mm -hmm. It's nothing spectacular, but they got a few chairs out here and some picnic tables to sit. Oh, see him, see him. Hey, buddy. 